All right, we have game one in the bag, which leads us to our second game in the opening round, the 2000-2001 team, um, led by Casey Calvary, 19 points a game, Dan Dickow, 18.9 points, six assists. Um, that team went 26-7, and seven, lost to Michigan State in the Sweet 16, uh, versus uh, number three seed, the 2009-2010 team, led by Sacre, Bolden, um, and Stephen Gray, which was 27-7, and seven, lost to Syracuse in the second round, and finished the season ranked 22nd. So even though they're a three seed against this uh, uh, unranked two seed, um, they come in as an underdog. Uh, anyone have thoughts? Do you remember these two teams, Stephanie? I do, yes. Um, but I, I would have to go with uh, the second seed, 2000, 2001. I mean, look at their muscles. Look at their muscles. <laughs> do you remember Dan Dickow's curly hair? I do. Yes. So you prefer, you prefer Dickow's hair over Bolden's hair? <laughs> you know, yes, because he's more my age. <laughs> Sorry about that. <laughs> I am married. Uh, yeah, I, I go with the 2000, 2001 team. Well, the, the one thing I question about the 2000-2001 is Casey Calvary listed at 6'8". Yeah. We're talking 6'6 six, six in the <laughs> maybe. Yeah, but one of the nastiest guys to ever wear a GU uniform, one of the nastiest yeah. guys to ever play probably college basketball, period. Yeah. I mean, just tough as nails. And that's, you know, I mean, when you look at, the, at these two teams, I think that's one of the things is, I mean, you know, Bolden and Gray and, you know, and Harris, I mean, those guys had unbelievable careers. And obviously, Rob was a, was a favorite, but... Man, I mean, Casey was, was so tough, and then Dan could shoot it. You know, Blake is a freshman before he, you know, started battling the knee injuries. You know, I mean, him and, and Dick down on the backcourt, that's, uh, that's a pretty special team. And Zach Gord as a sophomore was, was playing well. But I think, too, their, their bench. You know, we were talking about Anthony Reason a little bit earlier, you know, a little bit underrated. Um, and, and, you know, and Alex Hernandez was, uh, was tough, and Kyle Bankhead could shoot it a little bit. Mm -hmm. You know, you talk to some of those guys on that team, they say he was one of the better defenders they had. I mean, I think when you look at that group from top to bottom, uh, I think I like the team that uh, Steph likes. Thank you. <laughs> no love for Bull Kong coming off the bench? Um, a little erratic, I would say. Yeah. I think that's erratic would wait to work. work. Sure. Yeah. Recru recruited his brother King. Yeah. King. Better. <laughs> yeah, I think you look at the 2001 team, and, and really what swings it here for me are the guards. You can't, uh, and I love Stephen Gray to death. He might be as one of my favorite Zags, and not just because he was in a play, yeah. <laughs> but uh, but still, we dick out and step. You're, yeah, that's pretty good guard tandem to, to have to be. And I, I had forgotten that Casey Calvert averaged 19 points a game. That doesn't seem right to me, but I'm sure it is. It's just, like 16 on dunks. Yeah, <laughs> and you're slightly higher than that. It was about 18 and a half. <laughs> yeah. yeah, 13 of those on putback. Yeah, videos. and two out of three at the line, and that was. <laughs> So, so Elias Harris is a freshman, though. Remember, he, he was, was terrific. He was so good as a freshman. He was, I mean, who's going to guard him? Fifteen from and that seven, team? right? As a freshman. Yeah, yeah. as a freshman. And you remember how explosive he was? Yeah, fearless. Yeah. Um, anyone else have thoughts before we vote? All right, let's vote for the second game: 2000-2001 versus 2009-2010. Are we ready? Mm -hmm. All right, show the cameras. Jim, you have 01? 01. Stephanie, 01. Oh, unanimous again. Following seating so far. I was going to put 94 down, but I didn't <laughs> slide, Jess. We've, uh, the, the Can we speak to you? It's a wild card. Are we get a wild card team? In the, the playing games? Yeah. <laughs>